Car fans in the USA are not only really fond of powerful or especially environmentally friendly cars, it's also okay if your set of wheels shows people that you enjoy life. You can marvel at examples of both these things at the VW stand at the Los Angeles Auto Show. The new U.S. Passat makes its motor show debut in L.A. The facelift is not just a visual makeover. A few things have changed beneath the bodywork. New electronic and infotainment systems have been fitted to make the Passat fit for the future in the USA. When it comes to driver assistance systems too, the U.S. Passat no longer has to live in the shadow of its European brother. The choice of engines ranges from 167 bhp to 276 bhp. This is what it looks like, the winner of the Global Rally Cross Championship. In this Beetle GRC, the former Formula One driver Scott Speed won the championship title. While it's unlikely that anyone will have a 552 bhp racing version of the Beetle in their garage, it could be quite a different thing with the Beetle Dune. This crossover model, which is reminiscent of the legendary Baja California buggy, is a real crowd puller. A host of off-road possibilities. Big 18-inch wheels and bodywork with 10 millimeters more ground clearance combined to make a distinctive design. You can recognize the Beetle Dune from the front by a large central air inlet with a black honeycomb grille. The silhouette is characterized by the black wheel arch and bodywork extensions. The black side strips are an amusing feature. They commemorate the style of the old running boards of the legendary rear engine Beetle. The Beetle Dune won't just be built as a limousine. The convertible is bound to have a lot of fans in the sunshine state. The boss of Volkswagen America, Michael Horn, is surrounded like a pop star at every event these days. The reasons for this, however, are common knowledge. But the crisis is a chance for Europe's largest car maker to make a sustainable contribution to the future of the car and of mobility. The Wolfsburg manufacturers have proved in Los Angeles that they have plenty of ideas when it comes to cars that fascinate.